Once again, it's time for another El Clasico. Real Madrid against Barcelona. Another chance for myself to go and make the city of Barcelona proud once again. Recently, well, let's just say we've been dominating this El Clasico series. Real Madrid, they haven't had much luck against us. Barcelona winning the treble and we cannot be beat in this match. Heading to Madrid and well, the players of Real Madrid are just sitting back, watching film, trying to figure out ways they can crack this spell against us and finally come away on top because Barcelona has just flat out been dominating. Boys, El Clasico is just moments away, but before we begin, Adidas hit me up with some new cleats to wear before this match. So we're going into this game with the fresh boots and it's all time on the bus ride to the stadium ready to get this match underway the nerves are real even though this isn't my first time in the El Clasico matchup walking into the stadium well I just know it's time for me to shine pick up some goals and lead my club to victory once again FC Barcelona ready to take the field it's here once again it is here el clasico it's all about to be underway And here we go, the wait is finally over. Real Madrid, Barcelona, if you're watching this on the day that I posted this video, El Clasico in real life was yesterday and Real Madrid came away with a victory, so we need to cut that. We do not want that to happen today. It is time, here is their lineup. Ian Robin in there at the right midfield position, my arch rival, as you guys know. Kareem Benzema and so many other great players for Madrid. This game is not going to be easy for us away from home as well. Here is our starting 11. Barkley up top along with Messi. Midfield consists of Roberto Busquets, Muller in that back line. PK and Mascherano at the center back position. It's time kickoff here in Madrid. El Clasico is underway and the first chance is going to fall to Real Madrid with a chance for Ian Robin but the shots just goes over the bar what an opportunity right there great shots from number 50 iron robin and barcelona would follow up with another chance and well we do this Just another insane goal from Barcelona, and it comes from the young man, Alexander Barkley, putting Barcelona up 1-0 very early on in this match, and Real Madrid would come straight back on the attack in the 10th minute. A chance for them from a free kick. Robin, he missed the first opportunity, but can Karim Benzema put this one in from a free kick here he is set up to the spot taking the shot and into the back of the net what a goal from Kareem Benzema it is all knotted up here we're level the equalizer from Benzema what a goal free kick Claudio Bravo he can't quite save it just an insane strike you got to give credit right there unfortunately we couldn't hold that lead for too long the score guys it's 1-1 
all in a matter of moments both teams get opening goals so we're gonna have to work hard to get that lead back and we would do so straight after this so many chances coming early in this match just a few minutes later another opportunity for us i'm in the box calling for it from across from one of our wingers sending the ball in alexander barkley puts it into the back of the net once again it's 2-1 just like that we lose the lead and get it right back. The cross, the header, the goal for Barcelona away from home. I just come out of nowhere, headed into the back of the net, giving us the lead to one just like that, boys. It's as easy as that. Barkley putting this team on his back, willing them hopefully to a victory. Just an insane goal. Got to give credit to the assist, though. Great pass in and to find me there. Seventh goal in La Liga, what a performance thus far, and that would be it for the first half right here, boys. Whistle finally is going to blow, and we are 45 minutes into this match, and Barcelona is winning here in Madrid, coming into hostile grounds, and right now, we have all three points. We want to walk out with all three points, though. We need to hold this lead, possibly add on. It's not going to be easy, though. We were lucky to get two goals right there from two really 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 good goals and starting things off another chance for us to pick up a third goal right here another cross and in this time by Lionel Messi I can't put my head on it this time and Thomas Muller right here he's gonna make a mistake is it going to be a red card no it's not it's a yellow card luckily Thomas Muller in the 64th minute picks up a yellow card hopefully he doesn't pick up a red card that would be terrible and look at this Barkley Putting on the skill, passing it to Sergio Roberto, but he misses, and again, more skill from Barkley. Look at this, just beating defenders left and right, dribbling around, passing it in the box, and it leads to nothing once again. All that skill for nothing, and boys, that's the end of the match. Barcelona's going to walk away with a win. In El Clasico, 2-1 is the scoreline. Barkley, man of the match with those two goals. Just an outstanding performance from the young American, the American legend. What do you guys expect from him but that game set match? Three points for Barcelona. After a big, big win in El Clasico, you would expect us to be going out, having a good time, partying it up, but it's exactly the opposite. Enough of that. Enough of the partying. That is in the past for us. We need to get back to work because we're still not in the first spot in the BBVA. We're in second place. So me and my teammates, instead of going out to party, we headed into the office here at Barcelona to watch some film and then later on after that hitting up the practice fields early that morning we need to get as much work in as possible like I said still not in that first spot in the BBVA we want to get in that first spot that is our goal so yeah hitting up the practice field hitting up the film room watching some gameplay and really working on more things that we can hopefully improve on here Heading into our next match, after beating Real Madrid, we are very confident that we can get a win here, especially because this one is at home. Let's see what we can do right here in front of our home fans. Barkley, two goals in that last match, two insane goals at that. And as we start things out, Barkley, he's back to his old tricks, and... Great pass is going to be sent in. More skill and, well, than this. Yes, another goal from Barkley, his third of the episode, and I know all you guys are saying that I'm being too greedy. I'm sorry, if the shots are there, I'm going to take them, and once again, Barkley on it, taking the shots. Yeah. 
and putting it into the back of the net. What a goal from Barkley off the volley. An insane strike, putting Barcelona up 2-0. But hold on. I was offside. That would have been an insane goal, and I was clearly offside. No questioning that. The volley, first time. Oh my god, that would have been insane if it had counted our opposition here with a chance. And I am just so, so pissed about that. Oh my god, the score remains 1 0. And here, our opposition dribbling around the back end, passing it back to the goalkeeper. And what just happened? 2 0, just like that. No, no, cut the music, cut the music. What in the hell? He gets nutmegged by his own teammates. You know what? Turn the music back on. Keep it going. 2-0 for Barcelona. We will take that goal. That is just flat out embarrassing. No clue what happened there, guys. When that goal was scored, I was just shaking my head in disbelief. 2-0. We will take it, boys. Just like that. Barcelona, another goal in our opposition with later... Get that goal back. 2-1 from the cross. The header flies into the back of the net. Our lead is cut in half right there. Honestly, they deserve to have that one after the mistake they made. It was just embarrassing. And luckily, they get it back. The keeper won't feel as guilty now that they scored that goal. Because that was just embarrassing by the keeper. He gets nutmegged by his own player. Got to send that into like worst goals of the week or most embarrassing goals. I have no idea. It's 2-1 just like that. Heading into the halftime break. We have the lead. That is what matters most. Barcelona on top right now. And Barkley with that one lone goal. Should be two goals. But that volley was offside. I'm still pissed about that, boys. Would have been a great goal. 2-1 is the score in. Going into the locker room, the manager wanted to give Luis Suarez some playing time since Luis Suarez has not been playing much as of late. So, you know, I wasn't really complaining too much. I played two great games and we would pick up a win. So, Barcelona moving on with three points. And you guys know what is coming next. Barkley, he's had a great career thus far. Scoring goals, playing for great clubs, but up next, it is is episode number 100 smash a like if you guys can't wait for what's coming in episode number 100 it is coming soon